Allegations this morning against an Indian Hill couple accused of lying about the fire that burned their multi-million dollar home to the ground. It, no, we first reported Jeffrey and Maria Decker filing a lawsuit against their insurance company in January. But now, 9 on your side reporter Allie Kramer says the insurance company claims the couple story just isn't adding up. Good morning, Chris and Catherine. It's impossible to forget that fire that burned down that Indian Hill mansion. But now the couple that lived there, Jeffrey and Maria Decker, well, they sued their insurance company for $60 million, claiming that they weren't paid out their settlement just in time. But the insurance company, we're now learning this morning that they're countersuing, claiming that the couple lied during their investigation. Now that insurance company is claiming, is responding actually to the lawsuit, claiming that Jeffrey Decker, he Lied about just where he was before the fire began, and records show that the Decker, Deckers also might have lied about items in the house that were lost. Specifically, the insurance company says the amount of money that they claimed to have had in a safe. Now, during the investigation, the insurer Chubb National they actually paid out nearly seven hundred thousand dollars to the Deckers for living expenses while things were sorted out. Now, Chubb National is countersuing, saying that the Deckers intentionally misrepresented their claims, which is actually a breach of their contract. Now, the insurance company is asking for a jury trial in this matter, but it could be a very long time before we actually see this case go to court. Reporting live this morning in Indian Hill, Allie Kramer, 9 on your side. Allie, thank you. This